So now I have the ball, triple threat position. You have to respect my jump shot. So whereas the previous play, I create separation, I raise up and shoot. Now he's on top of that because he knows I might raise up and shoot at any moment. I've knocked down one, two, three shots in a row. So now I'm reading on the weak side and I'm seeing this big is late. So there's a gap behind him that I can penetrate if I take advantage of it. So now the important thing is just to be patient. I know I want to go right. And all this is happening in a split second. So now I'm going to bait him here and use a little semi fake and lean, get him leaning just a little bit. So now I can attack him. If I get by a guy here on the step and I'm going on this angle, once I get down here, I'll try to dip to get this angle going to the rim. In the perfect world, once you get by this guy here, he's already gone. There's nothing he can do to get in the play without fouling. Now I'm seeing this big coming over here, and I'm timing it, and I'm seeing what's going to happen. Now either I can dunk the ball, or if I want to create a foul situation where I know I can get a three-point play, I can create a bump and go on the other side, and use the rim for protection, and lay the ball up and get a three-point play. Whether it's high or low, or whether it's there, whether it's up there, you just want that ball to go in the basket. However you're comfortable getting it in there or spinning it in there, 